and welcome to episode four of Victoria's Villarreal. We are here against Real Madrid once again. I know we saw them last episode, but we didn't really play anyone of note after the Valencia game. But as you can see, we went and beat Osasuna 2-0, Getafe 4-0, Bilbao 3-2. What happened there? I think they, yeah, we were all over them and they just sort of scored a couple interesting goals. We just went and beat... Um, Real Sociedad and Alaves 3-1 respectively each and now we're here with Madrid but off camera and off YouTube we've gone and made two signings we've gone and brought Palacios in for next season who we know he is a fantastic uh, young midfielder and we've also brought our boy Thiago Almada with us as well who will probably train to play out on the left as an inverted winger so things are looking uh, promising for Villarreal for season 2021, but we do have a game to worry about here against top of the table Real Madrid, who are on 70 points. We've marched up the table pretty well. It looks like Betis have already played and they have lost their game. So this is a big opportunity for us to jump into third. This is going to be the team, and as you can see along the right hand side here, we've got Lee out injured for three months. We've got uh, Mendes sick for a few days. We've got Pedraza gone for a few days. Lamptey's out for five to ten days. Penner's out for two to three months. Karamoko Dembele's out for another few weeks. So the team is really on its knees at the moment with regards to who we can put out there. The t starting 11 is still strong and the bench is still strong, but the depth other than that isn't quite there. So. Let's, Let's see, see how we go. go. In, in the, the chat, we've got a 3-0 win to us. We've got a 2-1 dub to us as well. Uh, uh, no, we've got to change there. Instead of 3-0, it's 2-0. So here we go. Real Madrid line up with Militao, Varane, Ramos, Mendy, Casemiro, Modric, Cruz, Isco, Hazard, Benzema, Audrey Zola, Lucas Leiva, Jovic, Valverde, Nacho, and Rodrigo somehow wearing the number one strip there. Anyway, anyway, let's go. go. We're going to get passionate. We owe Real Madrid after them beating us 3-0. Last episode, time to play. So, let's change this over to Villarreal. I haven't changed anything about the way we play because of how strong it has been so far since we changed into the 4-4-2. But we're really trying to chase down Sevilla, who we still have to play as well. And we still have to play Real Betis and Atletico Madrid and Barcelona still in this second round of fixtures. So we've got some big, big games coming up. That's a good ball in to Sergio Ramos, and that is an easy penalty against Muletieri. So are we going to go 1-0 down early? Who steps up? Probably Benzema. Oh, Hazard steps up. And Rulli with a big save. Come on. That is huge for us. Well done, Rulli. He has been absolutely fantastic this season to the point where it made us sell Aston Joe in the transfer window but here we go I can't actually remember what I recapped I might have to go over the squad with you guys I did not check where we're at oh what a kick Gerard Moreno's through and we're one new up as well so we save a penalty go down the other end with an assist by Rulli as well and we go one new up at home to Real Madrid let's have a look at this again look at that kick there from Rulli that's gone three quarters of the pitch and Moreno slots it past Thibaut Courtois and that is a huge, huge moment in our season. Modric, good ball in. All the way to the back post to Varane, who scored a screamer against us last time. Esposito closes Cruz down. We're on Ramos. We're pressing really well here. Can we win this ball back? Thomas Party looks like he's going to get it under control. Plays really under a bit of pressure. He just hoofs it out to Militao. Here we go. Madrid starting to get settled on the ball now. Casemiro, Cruz, Benzema, Hazard. This is good football from Real Madrid. Mendy driving down the left side. Can we just keep him there? Hazard, open goal, one all. God damn it. <sighs> it does not matter. Good play from Real Madrid. I don't know where Rulli was going, to be fair. Look where his position... Look where Rulli is. Why is he so far away from the goal? What are you doing? We're going to leave it as it is. Here we go. Courtois, short into Ramos. Can we go and put some pressure on the ball? Here we go. Thomas Party Get it inside to Gian Mario. No, it takes off by himself. Thomas Party just driving down the right wing. Ball in. Gerard Moreno. Good save, Courtois. Straight at him. Come on, lads. Time to get creative. We're in this game. Well, I've got the ladder twice here. I just realized. We want match stats. There we go. 
So we haven't had a whole lot of possession that we're used to, but we've created just as many chances as Real Madrid, which is a very positive sign so far. And we look like we're playing quite well other than dominating possession, which, again, doesn't bother me massively. I'm pretty happy, though, with no highlights for a little bit. Just let this game calm down just a bit. They want to try moving the ball forward with long balls. I don't really want to do that. Modric, ball in, Ramos, over the bar. We will take that. And let's just get to half time at one or I wouldn't mind that, to be honest. I'm going to tell the boys to get creative, though, to see how they respond to that bit of feedback. And we are marching on up the ladder, which I'm more than happy about. So, can we just get to half time here at 1 1? Let the boys regroup a little bit, have a bit of a chat. Whilst we're here, nothing's happening. Mallorca look like they're going to get relegated. Ibar can probably get out, and Espanyol will probably join them. Bubba, long throw, flick on from Esposito, doesn't go anywhere. Isco finds Benzema one on one. Can we get out there and just close him down? No penalty, please. So it have held him up well. Isco, Casemiro, shot blocked. Casemiro go all the way back to Courtois, and Moreno's taken off here. Moreno wants Courtois. Good ball out to Mendy, into Ramos, finding Cruz. Madrid really starting to dictate the way we're playing. But here we go. Ball through. Jean Mario. Step on it. Come out if you need to. Play it. Why does he not play it just here? Just drop it short there to Sam. It's so frustrating. Here you go. Jean Mario. Ball in. Oh, Esposito. He hasn't scored for a few games actually now, Esposito, after going through a real purple patch of form. Ball in. Goal. Boys, come on. What are we doing? Easy free header from the corner. Modric whipped the ball in. Casemiro loses his man. Time to demand more. Can we grab one before half time, potentially? Minute to go. Probably no highlight. All right, we're at half time. Dressing room. Passionate. We owe Real Madrid. That should pump him up a little bit. Let's go. Opposition. What have we got on the opposition? We're going to go show on to weaker foot for all three attackers. We're going to go tight. Tight marking on the midfielders. What's that? Tackle hard. And then which one's pressing? It's this thingy here. We're going to press both centre backs and the goalkeeper. Let's go. Start the second half. Let's go. Can we grab an early goal here as we get a highlight towards Esposito? Militao, good chest down to Varane. Back to Militao. Here we go. Mulatieri finds Esposito. Can he compose himself? Moreno, step on the ball. He's got no one to go to, and we lose the ball. Hazard, well done, Sam. Goes back to Albiol. Oh, how's that not our ball still? Come on. Let's go. Let's get creative, boys. Let's try and find something. Mulatieri's probably going to come off. At some point now as well. Because we are going to need a goal. And some extra legs out wide. But our bench is quite depleted. So I don't actually know who we're going to bring on. Okay. We're going to keep it. Here we go. Bubba. Long throw. Gian Mario. Gian Moreno. Mulatieri. Oh, just wide. Come on, boys. We're playing well. It's just we need to get one more clear-cut opportunity in the back of the net. All right, Mulisieri starting to struggle a little bit. I don't really know who we're going to play at left mid there. Hmm. We might have to do that. And go Ryan at right mid. That's what we'll do. We've just got no attacking depth anymore. All our attacking depth are injured at the moment. It's crazy. We've had seven shots on target to their four. Come on. Can we find something? Thomas Party. Oh, come on. They're playing well as well. This is what's so annoying. We're really giving Real Madrid a run for their money. Courtois throws out to Mendy. Can we get out there? Sam wins it. Oh, he doesn't quite win it. Modric into Cruz. Back into Modric. Come on. We've said we want to press here. Giamario. Esposito. Come on, Esposito. Cut back if you can. We're, just, we're creating chances. We're looking good. I might actually take Esposito off for our young striker as well. Just to get some fresh legs up front. Sam is also struggling, but he'll just have to play through it. 
Bartol is going to come on for Esposito. Give us some fresh legs up front. And Gian Mario is going to go out on the right. And Pareo is going to jump into the middle and try and dictate things for us. He's going to go as an advance on attack. Let's go. Come on, boys. Can we find an equaliser against Real Madrid with 20 points clear at the top? Torres. Felipe. Oh, Cruz. Well, he's offside anyway. All right, we're going very attacking here. We're going to chase the game. Wingers are going to step a bit higher up as well now. Come on, boys. Can we grab an equaliser here against Real Madrid at home? Time to demand more. Come on, boys. Can we find a second goal? We've had 10 shots on target to four. We've given them a real game of it so far, and it's showing us that we are at this standard. We are good enough to compete with the best in the league, who are 20 points ahead at the moment. We've used our three subs. We've changed everything we can. Time is ticking away. Courtois, short to Ramos. Long ball into Modric, finding Lucas Leiva. Back to Modric. They're picking us apart now because we've got no midfield. Isco, Cruz, reads it well. Jao Mario out wide. Can he pick a ball? Into Parejo, finding Ryan, cuts in. Ryan, Boris, oh, Boris, I just combined his name. Come on, Bartol. Cautious, let's go, we're going to hold on now. Get the wingers, oh, I'm pausing it. Wingers, uh, what do we, box to box? No, he's going to be deep lying, defend. Deep lying on defend, defend, defend. Support and support. Here we go, boys. Come on. I know it's a bit negative. Can we just hold on? Can we just hold on, boys, for a draw against Real Madrid? Oh, Driozola. He's driving at us. Ball in. Good save, really. Highlight's still alive. Does really just smack it long? He doesn't. He rolls it out to party under pressure. Cruz keeps it. Jao Mario. Is there a goal for Villarreal here? Oh, well done, Lucas. Oh, and Jao Mario's been injured. All right, he's going to have to deal with it for five minutes. Come on. Our highlight. Really long kick forward. Come on, Bartol. Bartol, chip him. Chip him. It's it. Oh, it's wide. What's going on here? Oh, I was offside. I'm praising the boys. This has been chaos. No highlight. Give me the draw. I'll take the draw. Done deal. I will take two all. I know we'll one new up. But that is a huge result for us. We've done brilliantly there. I am taking that and I'm running with it. Six to eight days, another injury. How good's that? Nine games in a row, unbeaten. And I am very, very happy with that result. We'll take that and run against Real Madrid. And YouTube, you'll see us here against Real Betis. Yeah, and then we'll go Barcelona, Atletico and Sevilla to finish the season off in one big episode. So... You will see us in a few games' time in just one moment. YouTube, let's make a start. We are here taking on Real Betis now. We've not very long to go left in the league. We went and beat Ibar 2 0. Uh, it took us two late goals, but we were the better side on the day. We then went and lost to Levante, which hurt a little bit, and I didn't think we deserved to lose. We played quite well. And then we went and beat Leganes 4-1, which was a good result for us. But it doesn't matter. We are here today to take on Real Betis. We are here with our 4-4-2. I've reinstated Parejo back into the starting 11. I thought might as well use him whilst we've got him. His stats are very, very good. And his pace is pretty generous, seeing that on FIFA he is extremely slow. Um, once again, though, the squad is decimated. So a lot of guys are out and about with injuries and international stuff. So... Anyway, that's how we're going to roll. We're going to switch these two around, actually, and we're going to go like that. So, this game here is the definition of a six-pointer. I'll show you the league table once we get into the game. They've got Nabil Fakir, Guadado. They've got a good side here, actually. They've got a very, very good side. So, let's go. We're going to get passionate. We can move into qualifying spots if we get the win. Let's go. Let's play some football. So, we're sitting fifth. They're fourth, we're equal on points, and we get the first highlight. Ball in, I'll be oh, there we go, look at that, two minutes in. That is amazing. Great start for us here. 
Great header as well. Time to, to praise the boys after, after that. that. Come on, guys. We really need three points here today to push us up to third pending Atletico Madrid's game. But we still need to play Atletico Madrid as well. Let's go. Come on, boys. We are desperate for three points here. As the chat goes nuts, we've got a 3-1 dub in the chat as well from our long-time viewer, JS. Hoping that he's right again, as he was in the last game, actually, against Leganes. Pareo, first game for him in a while. It's a bit of a risk to bring him in, but just with the injuries and things at the moment, the squad was getting a bit thin, and that is a great ball out to Mulatieri. Finding Bubba on the inside. Puts a ball in. Sam, ooh. Come on, guys. We are playing... Some good football here, but for Kier, we know he's got quality. Ball in, over the top. We'll take that and we'll run with it as well. All right, we're going to just tell the boys, let's get creative. I want a second goal here. The centre-backs have been putting in absolute work um, in an attacking sense so far this season as well. Between Albiol and Pau Torres, I reckon they've scored probably 15 goals. Here we go, Gerard Moreno. Esposito hasn't scored much lately, and that's not far wide, actually, from Gerard Moreno, to be perfectly honest. Another highlight. This game is full of highlights so far. Felipe, a young right back. Ball in. Doesn't find Bubba. It goes back to Felipe. Albiol. Bubba strikes it with his weak foot and puts us 2 0 to the good. That is some effort. Well done from Bubba. First goal for the club. On his weak foot, first time. Just goes bang. Thanks for coming. Time to praise the boys for that. That is a huge, huge, huge moment in this game. All right, let's go. Come on, lads. Can we just hold Real Betis off for a bit? I think we lost to them when we played them in the league. It'll be interesting to see who Atletico Madrid have as well. Mallorca are pretty much dead and buried now as well. All right, we are playing well. I'm going to praise the boys. We're going to keep them in good spirits. Come on, lads. Come on, boys. Can we? Oh, God. Here we go. Mandy. Oh, really? That is that is bad. That's his first big mistake of the season, and this is not the game to make it. He just pushed the ball in the net for them. Come on, boys. That is not ideal. Here we go. Oh, no. Iglesias is through. Oh, my God, he's put it wide as well. Whew. Very, very lucky there, actually. All right, here we go. Come on. Time to demand a bit more. We've been the better side here. We can't let Rio better straight back into the game with a defensive mistake like that. So, Tello, Guardado, Iglesias. These are good names that they've got here, too. Fakir, Carvalho, Finding Nego. Come on, got to win that ball. Party does well. Finding Pareo. He doesn't actually find him. Nego driving, finding Fakir. Mandy out wide. Does he get a ball in? Bit of an under underlap there. Come on, Esposito. He hasn't scored for a while. Can we get Esposito on the score? Score sheet. And he does well done, Sebastiano. Great finish. That's what we want to see from the young striker. He scored 15 this season. For you know, a 20 year old, it's actually a pretty good return. Um, seeing that we only played, what, two cup games as well, which I don't think he played. So it's 15 league goals. For him this season so more than happy with that return and Moreno's really started to pick up his return lately as well so can we just tick our way into half time 3-1 to the good which is what JS's score prediction was so let's leave it there for the first half please no highlight there we go good 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 let's get passionate great opportunity to show the pundits that we mean business Three assists coming from the two centre-backs and the right-back. So, wouldn't mind our midfielders getting a bit more involved in the build-up play. But, party, flick on. Esposito, he's just got to get something on there. Good little header there from Thomas Party as well. Bravo, smacks it long. Christian Tello, who burns one. And then Felipe does very well. Sam hits it long. Moreno gets there first. Can he get on his left foot? He does, but he doesn't strike it well, apparently. Anyway, Mulatieri, Thomas Party, Sam's actually struggling. So we'll probably get Karamoko on soon. Bubba deals with it. Esposito, time to go to the races, Esposito. Come on, Sebastiano. And he falls over himself. Well done. 
<sighs> can we just not concede just for a little bit? Just want to keep them out of the game. We've dropped off very deep there, which isn't ideal. Nego, ball in. Finding Christian Tello. Please don't concede here, boys. Well done, Ruli. It's a very, very tense game so far. We're going to take Sam off because he hasn't done anything either. So we're going to get Dembele on and we're going to get Jamario on as well. He hasn't played recently. All right, I'm a little nervous here. Three points would be absolutely massive for us in the push for Champions League football with Real Betis going a full game behind us and a worse goal difference too. So we definitely need this result. This result would be massive for us. Come on, boys. Torres into Parejo, into Bubba, finding Muletieri out wide. He just slides one there for Esposito. We can't get there. And here's a counter-attacking chance for Real Betis. Iglesias through. And he's over the bar by quite some margin. Can we just hold on for a little bit longer before we make another change as well? It's like Muletieri would probably be that change. If I've got another winger, I think Ryan can probably play out there just to finish the game off. I just want to try and get to that 75th minute, 80th minute before we look at making another change. But the way we've turned around this season has been absolutely massive for the whole club. So here we are, Bubba, Esposito. Drifts out very wide to get on the ball, actually. Bubba hasn't really got anyone to play to. He just dinks one over to Karamoko. Oh, on his weaker foot, though. I don't know why he didn't cut that back across onto his left foot either. Jamario, ball in. Now be all over the bar. And the set piece is almost working once again. Just going to praise the boys here, just to keep mucking about. Bubba's starting to struggle. Mulatieri really struggling. Do we have a left mid on the bench? Not really. All right, I think Ryan is going to have to do a roll out there for us. On that left-hand side. Come on, boys. Can we hold on? 3-1. Really into Albiol. Where's his ball going? Hit the wing. Oh, he's been caught in possession, but he does well. Wins it back. Finding Gian Mario with a ball. Esposito can finish the game. And he hits it straight at Bravo. Come on, lads. One more. One more goal. Just really put Betis away. I think if Betis score one, I mean, real squeaky bum time. But we've been the better side by a country mile today. And we deserve these three points. Moving into a tricky period where we have to play Atletico Madrid, Barcelona... And severe still. So we don't have an easy way to finish the season. And you're well offside. But Gerard Moreno has done very well there. And once again, straight at Claudio Bravo, which I don't particularly like. And that is Wami driving at us down the left. Can we get a block in? Well done, Albiol. No penalty here, boys. That's over the bar. We'll take that. All right, time to go cautious. We're going to tell the boys to concentrate. We don't want to... Throw away a goal here. We want to keep the score at 3-1 and make JS happy that he's got two results correct in a row. Karamoko, average ball out wide, but it falls to Torres. Ryan driving. Can he get a ball back post? He can't. And here come Betis. This game's been end-to-end. -end. Here we go. Can we just go to him, somebody? Iglesias, good block again. Power Torres. He has been fantastic for us this whole season. Can we just finish the game strong? Don't concede. Our Biol clearing. Can we get some pressure out there? I'm even happier with that, to be honest. All right, really, Our Biol. Let's just keep the ball, boys. No need to panic. No need to rush. Karamoko. I don't know why you're smacking it for. Dembele. Play the right wing. There we go. Cruz, the fullback, gets on. Can he get a ball in? Finds Gerard Moreno, who keeps the ball. Giamario into Karamoko. Back to Giamario. Cruz. Jamario, we're keeping the ball very well here, actually. I'm not going to lie. That's a good ball. Karamoko, can he cut it across the box? Gerard Moreno, and it's 4-1. And JS loses his score prediction, unfortunately. is Gerard Moreno. And there's some fantastic football there by the boys, too, to be honest. Praising the boys. That is amazing. We needed that win big time. That puts pressure on Atletico Madrid to get a result as well in their game. And I'm not sure who they're playing, but that's a poor ball from Pau Torres. I thought the game would have been over. Fakir, straight at Rulli. And that should be all she wrote. Rulli just hit it forward. 
get us to the final whistle. Bang, punts it forward. That is the game set and match. We walk away 4-1 winners. And that is where we're going to leave it. So what have we got here? We've got press conference and YouTube. You are going to see us, I reckon, for Barcelona, Atletico Madrid, and Sevilla, as I said earlier. So the next episode, episode five, that will be, will be the last of this season. So if you like this episode, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe here on YouTube. And make sure you come over to Twitch at Paulie29 to catch all the victorious Villarreal content live. So thank you and have a wonderful day.